Okay. We'll be quiet. Yes. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Saturday stream in Ravenheim. It's good to see everybody here. Thank you for everyone showing up early. You're welcome, TK. <laughs> TK was uh, wanting to be a mod. And I know exactly why TK wants to be a mod. It's because TK thinks that he's going to be able to catch me in quotes. <laughs> Little does TK know I don't have quotes turned on yet. <laughs> but you can help me with bots. <laughs> Kick them out. <laughs> I am going to get quotes on. It's my goal to get quotes on. Hopefully by the next stream. Which hopefully will be Wednesday. I'm sorry I was so out of touch this past week guys. I didn't get my normal stuff done. I had other yeah. stuff going on behind the scenes that was kind of taking up my time and resources, but that's calming down now. So it's good to see you guys again. Who else here? TK's here, of course. Zane is here. Welcome to the Happy Gamer Gang, Zane. It's good to see you. And enjoy those emotes. You get to use all the fun ones. Give me skull and crossbones when I die, like some people love to do. <laughs> ah, let's see, who else is here? Varun. Hello. Hey, Paula. Welcome in. Hi, Ari. Good to see you. Daedalus. Hi. Just filling up, just finished filling a whole boat with iron. Cool. I saw Broadbrent do it, so I figured I would try. You won't be doing that again? Oh, no. Well, I'm going to be doing that at some point very soon. I've been mining iron all week long. Um. <laughs> Hi, Yomogami. Nice to see you. Hey, Felix. Welcome in. So my goal today is to work on spawn preventing the village because... I'm kind of really tired of getting raids in the village. It's kind I'm kind of over it. It's I, I have never lived in a place that had raids inside before. So yeah, I'm over it. I'm, I'm going to take care of it today. And then I have Magzag and Smitty here with me. Hi, guys. Hello. Hello. And then Smitty doesn't have to be afraid to play on his own anymore. Yeah. <laughs> We won't There's a be problem. Getting, we won't be getting raids inside. The it village. actually happened when I was building the hype house. I there was a troll raid, and I had built the thing too close to the the wall, like our retainer wall or whatever. And the guy, uh, the troll, had a tree and was just smacking the crap out of the corner of the hype house and like oh, broke no. all of it. Yeah. It's tragic. That is tragic. <laughs> So, the high pass is pretty close to the wall. <laughs> I had to out more just so that wouldn't happen again. But so it's out of troll range now. Yeah, okay. yeah. V's house is basically the wall itself. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's like a good house. <laughs> and I'm, I mean, he does not have good prevention there. I'm afraid to say. He said, "Oh, it's fine because." You know, whenever something happens, I just shoot arrows at them or fight them and they never get through the gate. But what if he's not there? You know, they yeah, can walk like right through. They can walk way. right in and smash everything. Mm hmm So. Well, V's going to learn if it happens. Yeah, I'm going to do something. I'm sorry, V, but... <laughs> and he can... Y'all can adjust it. I know, Megzeg, you live there too. Maybe you could give some input on it. Y'all can adjust yeah. that later, but I'm going to do something because I'm, I'm, no, we can't keep having raids in the village. It's just not acceptable. <laughs> not acceptable. I mean, unacceptable. Even, unacceptable. Even if it's something a little bit farther out from where he has his little fencing and stuff, but something's got to happen because I'm done with druggers walking in and smashing my building up for saw. <laughs> He knows what he did. Oh, watch out, oh. Smitty. Wait, why am I why am I dying? Hey Jigsaw, There's welcome a dragger in. Here. Oh. What the heck? Hi Frank. That's why you're dying. That's why. 
Got him. Thank you. You're welcome. A lot trashed your build, TK. That sucks. So I forgot when I logged in that I am in the swamp because I was finishing up mining all the crypts in my little swamp here. And I have like one tiny little room left in this one to go. And then I had one other crypt marked to get and apparently Smitty and Mags found it. <laughs> we did find it. We stumbled upon it and we're now raiding it. <laughs> Are mm -hmm. you in it right now? Yeah, we're in it. Maybe no. that's not the one Shh. I had marked. Don't tell her. I can't see <laughs> under your thing. Maybe there's one more there that I didn't have marked because I have one other one. It was a tiny little guy. It's maybe unassuming. You might have missed it. Maybe. All right, Megs. Hear how this works. I am the torchbearer, <laughs> <laughs> and you are the miner. All right, this is so, how it uh, worked last time, and it worked really well. Do you guys need some help before I go home and work on spawn prevention? Uh, That'd be nice, well, but yeah. up to you. Okay. I mean, I have some food on me. I have some arrows still. I could run over there and help you guys real quick. Yeah, come okay. join us in this beautiful, non-stinky crypt. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let me grab a piece of wood real quick and get my rested bonus before I run over there. Have you guys already started it or you're just now going in? Uh, we... We're in the middle. Okay. But like towards the beginning, we haven't really done much here. Torchbearer! I'm sorry, it went out. It went out. I had to grab another one. Let me grab my rested and I'll come help you guys finish that one up. Thank you. And after I get the spawn prevention done on the village, I was going to see about building a long boat because I have a lot of iron to haul back. But... Oh. Spawn prevention first. <laughs> Do I get to drive it? I don't know. I'll have... I, I'll I think probably, you want me to drive it. Um, I don't want you to drive oh. it. Smitty, uh, there's someone at the door for you. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Hi, John. Welcome are, in. Are you in a safe spot? You I seem to safe. be in a safe spot. I'll just smash him from afar. Yeah. <laughs> He's just looking up at you. It's the new meta. Look at this. This is how you do it. <laughs> Where are you guys at? Oh, uh, I destroyed. Go. You gonna All lose? Right. Back to work, Mags. Oh, man. There's so Quit many. Slacking. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> well, we gotta. We're full of iron. I don't know about you, but I can't pick up anymore. Uh. I could probably pick up a little bit more. Yeah, pull your weight. No, no, no. Give me the iron. I will carry it. And you can continue mining. Where are I'm you? I'm like a I little lost. See. Hey, let me pop up. Where you are. I mean, I, I, I'm near your icons, but I don't see you. Uh, where are you? Oh, we it's were, because like, like the, the tree. Yeah, it comes it's to because me now. our icons, yeah, don't stay at the entrance. Like when we're I wandering around the, oh, yeah. the crypts. Which one is you? Okay, you're the one over there. Yes, yeah. that was the last one that I had marked. Okay, so uh, okay. that's where the entrance is over there. Hello. Hi. Hello. Get up. Get up. Ugh, I hate being in the water in the swamp. Yeah. It's the worst. It's Magzog. Hello. Okay, come into my crypt. Everyone says <laughs> hello, ravens. Hello. This is hello, my hello. crib. <laughs> Your crib. Your I crib think we're this way. Quite the crypt. <laughs> yeah. Some water damage, but we're working on it. <laughs> You need to call a plumber, man. A little drafty. <laughs> right? Yeah. So have you and guys I left died in here play. yet? No. No. Wow, nice, not. nice. Why is this I'll... not broken out? This just needs to be done still. I didn't finish it. Smitty went in, left me to do all the work. I didn't want to do right, it. Man, you gotta watch him. I, mean, I didn't have any iron on me, so this will all be y'all's. Oh. Oh, no. 
Y'all need it. Yeah, it's you had a ton day. of iron in your little cart. That's because that I little operation my arse off. You are. I did all that by myself. That was crazy. <laughs> this whole swamp. One by one. How many cribs have you done? With knots in my stomach. <laughs> Is there anybody hiding in there? Oh, I don't pickaxe. know how many Broke, I've done. Smitty. Quite a few. Here. We gotta trade. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't want your pickaxe. You Emma got me high. That's okay. Smitty can just keep driving you crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Right, let's check to see if we have any visitors here. Oh. Oh no. Yep, there's visitors. I see them. Is there? Dead end. Yeah, on this side? Over here? Yeah. Um... Oh, this one keeps going? Oh. Yep. Oh, I see? think I was following Smitty. It's for you, Smitty. Mats. I'll get him. Come back. <laughs> uh, no, not yet. Oh! Watch out. Get him. He's coming. Oh. See, I smash, not he dies. This is a this is a good technique. Yeah. I've not oh. I've not seen this. I'm gonna run away for a second because I have not eaten. I think I got him. Nice that job. Last arrow. I don't hear a spawner in there, but you know what? My game sounds are turned really low right now because I was trying to hear somebody the other day. I need to turn them back up. Mm. I can barely hear the sound. I don't hear a spawner either. I think we're fine. I mean, I don't really want to hear the swamp sound so much, but <laughs> I should know if something's coming at me. Well, you don't like the goopy sounds? I hate the, the swamp flies sounds. buzzing. I hate it. I hate it. All of the swamp. Yeah, the. The bone mass sounds are particularly, uh, nice. Yeah. I often turn the music off when I'm in the swamp because it freaks me out. I've had to train myself. You know that sound that's, like, when you're outside walking around and it sounds like tumult, like something just flopped in the water behind you? Oh, I know. I know exactly what you're talking about. I hate that sound. I have had <laughs> to, like, nonstop train my brain and steal my gut that that is not actually something there. It's just a sound. There's no <laughs> yeah, it sounds that like there's a makes blob. That sound. But in my head, it's a dead body flopping in the water every time. Oh. Yeah. That's creepy. Freaks me out. Yeah, I, I still get that with the, the rustling in like the black forest and the meadows and stuff. Rustling? Yeah, there's like, it sounds like someone's like walking behind you. Now I'm gonna notice that. <laughs> yeah. yeah it'll, it'll freak you out for sure. That'd be great. Great. Seems to be a elite, a smitty. Oh, she oh. might want to get a And there's an archer. It's a spawner. I will distract them. No, I won't. Ow. Okay, we got one, there but we gotta go. get that spawner. Gotta get the elite too. The elites go, they run by really fast when they can't get through yeah. the door, so you gotta aim ahead of where they are. Alright, we'll distract <laughs> them. What are you doing? Oh, they're coming in. It's so bright. I, it's so bright. He's almost done. Get him. Yeah, you guys got there it. Go. There we go. Yeah. Look at all this treasure. Treasure? Where's the Please. treasure? Ooh. Everywhere. Ooh, See, this is what I'm after. In here too. In the oh, I'll take that. We're gonna get Smitty the belt today. Nice. Yeah. The fanny pack. Oops. Fanny yeah. pack, yes. Raymond Hunt fanny pack. Hey, Greg. You didn't know that. You didn't know what. If you destroy the roots in the crypt, you get wood from them. Oh, okay. I usually am just trying to carry all the weight of the iron. Mm. In the crypt. Yeah. So you can't really think about the wood. Let me check to see if there's anyone home. Okay. No, just there's keep going. There's many people there. 
Many, many. Your nemesis. Y'all have. Hi. Yeah, you can't oh. go back. <laughs> Y'all have poison potion with you? Cause... Are they dead? Nope. No, but I killed them. They're dead. I don't have any on me. Because I have the root mask now, so I don't carry it with me anymore. Trini nearly died a little bit earlier. From yeah. Block, but we won't talk about it. Uh, we don't even, <laughs> yeah, we don't even talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> no. Except I, I did, but we won't talk about it further. Poison is, uh... It's not my friend. I get wood iron from de destroying the chest in the crypts? What? What? Are you talking about in the sunken crypt? If I who's, destroy who's... this chest, I get wood iron? What are you talking wood about? Iron? Wood and iron, maybe? TK, I've never heard of that before. Can I, Go I for can't it. even destroy it. It is causing some damage. Very small. Does the hatchet work better for it? Frank, wrestling, not wrestling. Yeah, I got there eventually. <laughs> I got the wood that was in it, four wood, and some stone. That's all I got. Oh, well. I don't know. Unless you're talking about a different one, that's okay. Oh. Not wood iron, just wood. Oh, okay. I mean, that can be handy well, if you need a piece of wood to get your rusty bonus back at the beginning, too. Get a few pieces of stone and wood. Is that really good? Oh, speaking of rusty bonus, I do not have it. Mine's about to run out. We could go make a fire pit. Oh, there's a spawner. Okay. Oh, wait, no, there's just two. Get it. Got an archer. Might need to break it a little bit more. You gonna go in there, Smitty? Of course Let's he is. Go. You could go with it. I... Come on. Not. I don't think you're not. Nice job. Aww. That was anticlimactic. There's nothing in here. <laughs> I went in one crypt over here that there was literally nothing in it. Like, you walked in the <laughs> lobby and that was it. There was nowhere else to go. There was no muddy scrap pile covering up the <laughs> door. What a scam. <laughs> this is a waste of a key. Oh. Smitty, your extra pickaxe just broke. Oh, no. I can I thought I heard a finish her up here. Yeah, I'm here in the blobs. Yeah. If I had one more wood, I mean one more stone, I could make a fire to get everything rested down. Anybody have a stone? Um, I do not. No. Oh. Archer. Oh, ow, ow. There you go. Oh, Bob. Oh, running away. Oh, I don't have my mask on. That's it. I'm gonna die. Oh, no. No, don't die. Oh, no. Don't die. Do you have a health poster? Nope. <laughs> there more Does anyone have one? I ah, have quick. One. Come here. I need aid. I dropped it. Here. <laughs> Where is it? Got it? Uh, yeah. Oh. Okay, oh. I'll take mine back That then. was very close. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh. I remember Man, to eat. poison does get you. <laughs> <laughs> I dropped a bunch of iron scrap somewhere too. Oh, there I it is. I see something sparkling. Yay, we saved them. Hey, Jesus, yes. welcome to the stream. Is any treasure in there? No. Um. Oh, wow, this is it big. Just keeps going though, yeah. Oh, Bob. Oh, no. Ah. Oh, no, I got it. No, Go away. I got it. Poison again. <laughs> no. I got my mask. Hold on. Yeah, there you are. Do you get poison, Smitty? No. I did, but I think you did. there's some residual healing still going on, which is helpful. Did you eat? 
I did. Good. He has you and me both asking him if he ate. <laughs> did you eat? Do you have a potion? Do you need to get back? <laughs> he has us trained is what's happening here. Yes. <laughs> Enabling his behavior. <laughs> Enabling right. my behavior. Enabling his non-eating behavior. <laughs> I should probably head out. It's the weird still have to effect. effect. <laughs> um. Uh, yeah, I can't really carry anything else. To be honest. I am full. I'm um, full as well. I can carry a bit more. Oh no! My torch. It's gone. Did it die? Oh dear. Yeah. Well, time to head out. More I can carry. Yeah. Where are y'all gonna? Are you gonna use my portal to go back and repair? Yes. Probably. So. Looks like not nice. Have... Wherever that is. Do you have? Did you like not mark it? I can paint. I didn't it mark for it. You. I marked it. It's okay. Y'all have like a separate chest set up to sit your iron in since you can't take it through? No. Oh. Hmm. That would have been wise. I can make one. I'll make it on the other side. Do you know what I'm talking about, Christy? Yeah. Go ahead. Put in your iron, sweetie. Where? Oh, here. Right, right there. This one. Yes. Nice. Oh, I, I just have the antler. <laughs> oh, well. No, this needs a roof. So I Ari says, so maternal, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll switch it around. I'll stop eating, and then Smitty will remind me. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Take turns. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Um, Where's ooh. The oh, nice here. Well, we help yeah, everybody right? out. Right. More often, Smitty. <laughs> <laughs> Just sometimes, Smitty. I am very grateful, I will say. It makes it a fun adventure. <laughs> uh, um, Do you want your pickaxe back? Uh, I mean, you were really good with it, so... Take, take it back, I put it on the ground. <laughs> I put it on the ground. I mean, what's your pickaxe skill? Uh, lower than yours for sure. So low. What is it? 24. What's yours? Uh, one. <laughs> the liar. <laughs> <laughs> Uso! <laughs> that means liar in Japanese, in case Uso! you. Uso! There. It's right where you can see it. Jesus I don't want it though. Ustotsuke! Uh, let's see. Get rid of this. Yeah, you can see I started making paths too to be able to get my cart back. Mm. Where mm -hmm. I'm gonna have my boat. Die. Are you gonna make that trip today? Um, if I get, um, if I get the. What's my doodle done? Yeah. The, uh, the um, spawn prevention. Fire policing. Spawn the prevention. spawn prevention at the. What's my doodle? Yes. Yeah, at the what's my place. <laughs> mm, mm -hmm. At the village. <laughs> I'm gonna put all the other resources from this crypt in your chest too. Thanks. I don't know if you want them all, but I'll let well, you. Well, why don't you in. just take them, actually, because. We'll still have to transport them, and you're going to be transporting on your boat, so why don't you just consolidate them in, in what you have? But I mean, the rest of it you can bring through the portal. You Actually, mean the, the valuables? Like the entrails, and the ancient bark, and the ooze. Yeah. I mean, y'all do y'all care about withered bones, leather scraps and bones? Probably not. No. Right. Nah. Yeah, not really. Just leave those here. Nobody cares. Nobody cares about you. <laughs> With everyone. Smitty, here. Ooh, hello? Take that. You see? Take what? Take, take that. Oh, 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 gifts. Thank you. You're welcome. 
feel like you have to experience the joy that it is built, so... <laughs> yeah. You can see I've been smelting my iron along the way. Yeah! Efficient use of your time, for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I'm sitting in there. I may as well... Explore and smelt at the same time. Yeah. And I just move it with me from crypt to crypt, so I can just keep making progress as I go. Perfect. Is there still places in the crypt that we haven't finished? Yes, there is more. Quite a bit, right? It's a big crypt. Yeah, there is. Mags is doomed? Why is Mags doomed? Why am I doomed, whoever <laughs> said that? Yomagami. I would like to know. Yamagami says Mags is doomed. I don't believe it. I mean, doomed in what way? What kind of doom are we talking about? I'm waiting to hear. I'm waiting yeah, to I'm hear just like on what, the edge of my seat. What is... You must answer for this statement. <laughs> It's definitely because Christy's playing with her. What? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? <laughs> uh, oh, I must eat. He's saying that he does not want me to say where Smitty is. <laughs> <laughs> Could be a drinking game for the viewers. <laughs> yeah. How many times we say where's Smitty? Oh man, you're gonna really mess them up. <laughs> <laughs> Could be dangerous. Could be unethical even. Yeah. <laughs> okay, where Smitty, did you just go through the portal? No, I didn't. I'm just about to. I'm putting away the last of my junk. Where are you putting it? Are you putting it in here? I'll put the junk in here too. Yeah, I'm just throwing, like, I just have coal and stuff that I don't need to have. Okay. So I have ooze, ancient wood, and guts. Where did I put the roots? Um, I don't think there's a chest in here, because people have been making their own armor when they get them. You could put under, uh, I don't know, armor or miscellaneous or something? I don't think he made a chest for that. Yeah, I guess I'll just put it in my personal chest or something. Yeah, you could save it up for the root armor, if you want to get it. Get the mask first, I would recommend. Why? What does... Poison resist. Yeah. The mask is? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. And I have poison resist potions before you go back if you would like. Oh, it's just okay. too late. Yeah, I uh, I had put that in your uh, whatever barrel, whatever it's called. Oh yeah, Smitty learned how to make a potion today. Ooh, yeah, that's a very moving useful up skill. in the world. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, For sure. Okay, so the one that's in my fermenter is yours, so I'll remember that. And that's part of why I want to get the spawn prevention done, too. It's like, I want to build the cafe so people can have more than my little tiny house to do stuff. And it'll be, like, proper build for us to use, you know? Mm -hmm. Where are you thinking of building it? I already have it started. I have, like, the beginning oh. foundation of it started over there. Between um, the between unknowns build and the refinery, the smelter. Oh. I think, Smitty. I think we're done with the crypt. Is that all of it? Oh, what? Yeah. Really? Yeah, it ended. Oh no. Pretty quickly. You'll have to find another one. Although, Christy, you said you uh, explored this whole yeah, swamp? Yeah, that was it. That's the last one. Oh, okay. Gotta doing? find a new swamp. 
Yeah. I've been uh, working my way through that one. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I was watching Smitty punching a boar. Yeah, I was duking it out with this this guy. Get Must that he wanted all the yeah. He wanted all the smoke. Oh, I didn't rest. I just went back into the swamp without resting. How ridiculous! I've been known to do that. Yep. Okay, it's so it's hard when your rest isn't twenty-four hours or twenty-four minutes or whatever. You guys probably don't need any more help there, then, right? If that's it's all, all done, yeah. Okay. Just finished. Awesome. I'm gonna switch to builder's food then and go start working on spawn prevention. Mm. Very good. Smitty, you should go sell the valuables. See where you're at. Oh. Ooh, yeah. This is a good idea. Yes. I will go do this. This is part of the reason I want to get my cafe done too, because my tiny house is getting very cramped and I do not have <laughs> the storage situation going on that I want. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to do anything when your storage is limited. My storage uh -huh. is uh, one box next to a bed in B's house, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's much more limited than mine, I would say for sure. <laughs> I mean, it's my own fault. I could be building more storage. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the thing. The time I have had, I have ended up doing other things. Yeah. And just kind of staying in my tiny house. But I'm really kind of over it. Really, really kind of am. Oh, uh, Christy, there's yeah. a cartography table in the Hype House if you want to put your map Ooh. on it. So we can share. Fancy. Yes. I've built it for us to share our journeys. Awesome. Thank you for doing that. Yeah, no problem. Is the portal near the trader in Kyson's yes. place? Uh, Is that it? Okay. Yeah. Well, you could rename any portal to trader and it'd take you there, but. Would it? It's usually one in Kyson's. Let's yeah, not uh, sure create would. confusion. <laughs> What do you yeah, mean? Yeah, it would. It would. There's more than one portal going to the trader? Or, well, you'd have to unname the other one, though, wouldn't you? Yeah. Well, as long as Kaisen's one isn't named, then you could name it to that. I'm making it way too confusing. Yes. Yeah. Just <laughs> use the one in Kaisen's house. Yeah, I think his is named. To ah, the Elder. Ah, uh, come to. The Elder? The trader? Wait. This is the Elder por portal, I think. And then you. Oh, this is a different portal. No, wait. This is the same. Maybe it's the, the other portal. What? The other one. The other it one. Has two. Just... Ooh, frost. Oh, minor healing need. Nice. Over here, Smitty. Ah. Yes. Oh, hello. Eggfisher, uh, finally able to catch a Ravenheim stream. Good to see you. Hello. Haldor. Oh, I think he was saying that if... Mags, if you're counting on Smitty to remind you to eat, that you're doomed. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, that's fair. It's a fair point. So... Can't even remind himself to eat. Wait, I can't choose what to sell? Or what's, the, what am I? You just have to sell everything. Oh. Yeah, that'll turn Press it on to coins. Button. Oh, got it. 778. Still short. Ooh, you're so close. Maybe um, you can find a, somewhere around troll? here that hasn't been looted yet. Should I just get the hat? Or a black forest crow? No, 
What? Keep saving. Keep saving. Save for something looks... that matters. I mean, maybe. But I'm it looks kind of cool. But okay. But it looks cool. Wait, what hat are you buying? The circlet. Oh, uh, I thought yeah. you were talking about the Santa hat. Yeah. Oh, the Yule hat. Well, that too. <laughs> so I could buy. I could buy that, and then I could buy the Yule hat. Please. Don't get the Santa hat. I mean, do what you want. You're a grown man. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's tough. It's a tough choice. Oh, there's a boat here. Do you want to go steal the boat? You have to get the belt. The belt is the most helpful for sure. The others okay, are luxuries, okay. but I will. Be, I will be patient. I will be patient. Will. So, how can I find more gold then? Uh, we gotta find a crypt. Or more a crypt? troll. Or both. Yeah. Hmm. Crypts in the Black Forest have coins in them. Yeah. Wander around here for a little while, see if Where we find Yeah. Them. Where are you, Max? Let's, let's wander. Let's wander, yes. I'm just, I'm doing what you do. You know. It's a good strategy. Yeah, running headlong it's into the forest. Very effective. <laughs> you get somewhere. <laughs> yes. Although we're in the meadows right now, so it's very useless to be running headlong into the meadows. Yeah. That's See, true. All this broken stuff, it's because mobs are constantly attacking our houses and stuff. There's that is all true. kinds of stuff broken. Christy will right not now. stand for this. I shan't. I shan't. I've never lived this way before. It's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Can't take it anymore. How do people <laughs> live like this? <laughs> Don't understand. Maybe we should go up a mountain, Smitty. Is there a mountain? It's right there. Wait. You see the, where? the snow? Are we on the same, like, island continent that we started on? Like, that our... Or is this different? Is the trader uh, on a different like, it's island? Diff it's different. Oh. So and do you want to go up the mountain? I don't I think we can, can we? dare you to go to that tree right there. I don't think we can. Won't we die? Yeah, we'll die. Also, there's wolves. So if you hear uh, an awu, run away. An awu. Right. And also your health is dropping as long as you're up here. So just pay attention. I seem to be okay right now. If it goes down to half, you want to run away. Oh, okay. Fish. Oh, good point. That's, that's, I, I get the math there. Yeah. Yeah. It's the same uh, thing applies to swimming. Ah. Your stamina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's a Steve up here. Hello. Am I hearing any wolves? Although, uh, my health is falling. I'm not gonna be drawn into your shenanigans and die. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Quite the way to go for Magzag the, the Deathless. I cannot die like this. Although, if you die like that, I think it would be fun for you. I'm like, I cannot oh, live like this, side. and Magzag's like, I cannot die like this. <laughs> 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 Live or die, we can't do it the way that we're doing it. <laughs> right. <laughs> Hi, Sally Nene. How's the cafe coming along? Um, I've made a little bit of progress on it. I'll show you when I get back by there. But I'm working on spawn prevention in the village today because I cannot live like this. <laughs> it's crazy. You're like the roommate who confronts all the other roommates about the yeah. dishes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying get over there and do your frickin' dishes. I'm doing them myself, so... <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But Ravenheim definitely reminds me of living with roommates. You know, oh, yeah. somebody made a comment the other day that watching Ravenheim is like Valheim reality TV. <laughs> I mean, a little bit. <laughs> it kind of <Yeah>. is. <laughs> Wait. So there used to be a spawn here. We should here. throw mead into each other's faces. Mead. Or yes. mm, not. <laughs> How would you do I that? Mean, I mean, can you throw that? You can't throw things. They should well, make it pretend. so you can throw snowballs in the mountain. Oh, Smitty, look, there's a swamp. I want to throw 
rocks wow. back at gray dwarves. Yeah, that'd be nice. I throw Where's arrows this? back at them. Where's this one? <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's down here, somebody. You should just go ahead. Uh, Swamp means them. gold. Does it? Uh, well, kind of. Oh. oh, well. Uh, it's nighttime also. What are we? Do you want me to sleep? Oh that no. Would be nice. Yes. Oh, yeah. somebody's all the way down. Yeah, go ahead. Sleep now. Okay, let me run back. Before anything bad happens to Smitty. Yes. Smitty, uh, you could jump up the side. Um, Smitty, I'm gonna make a temporary bed in your house. Go for what it. What if I it? attracted these draugers to you? <laughs> oh. Oh, they're right Sorry. here. I see. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah someone please it. sleep because no, <laughs> there is a good chance. I'm not gonna hit his house. Smitty is like hanging from a cliff from one hand right now. That's basically yeah. what's happening. It's kind of a precarious situation here. So, do you want me to sleep or no? Uh, yes. It, it would be optimal right now. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and at the bottom of the cliff is a swamp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Kind of stuck. <laughs> here we go. Thank you. Really hope no wraiths come upon us while we're waiting. Oh boy. Sure, it's fine. Sure, it's, good. sure, it's, sure, it's great. It's great. Yeah, it's good. Great. Hey, Tiki, aloha. Look, you're alive. Now let's draw this draugr to you. What are you doing? Draw. How is this? <laughs> how is this helping the situation at all? Ah, they're coming. <laughs> Can you jump up? <laughs> okay, go down. Ah! They're gonna attack you. <laughs> I'm running a stamina. Oh! Go what down then. Go there's down. spider people. How? Spider. Go ah! down. <laughs> okay, there's no other option. Yeah, go there's down. No I'll come option. down with you. Don't worry. Run away. Spider people. Uh, Abby. I think they're climbing the the walls. They don't they don't slide <laughs> oh. down. That's what you meant. I got my drugger. You get yours. I'm just, I'm just running. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, if you run further, you <laughs> might attract more mob. Um, just saying. Uh oh. Uh hmm. Still behind you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Ah, oh, he's, he's mine. There you go. See, it was exciting that I drew the draugers to you while you were hanging out uh, there. I don't know. I don't know if I agree with that technique, though. Hey, Cherry! Welcome in! Ooh, I missed. Big Brother Valheim, right? <laughs> that curve is all crooked. Yes, I know. These walls are horrible. They're, I mean... And that's why I am, I am being the roommate that's saying, I can't live like this. I've got to do something about it. The rational <laughs> roommate, yes. <laughs> oh, there's a blob. It's flying. Oh, it's okay. Never mind. That's it's why we run time. away. It literally flew into the sky and disappeared. And then oh, the what is it's this over here? Hmm? No, it's not. I see green torches. And yes, Careful, it could right. be a spawner. The fences are not great. What? But what happened was somebody who saw remain unknown factions. To <laughs> went, wow. Subtle. <laughs> and did the elder before we had the village protected. And so <laughs> we kind of like Ooh, freaked wow. out. And I, you know, just like ran in here and didn't have time. And I like threw spawn crap just everywhere. And then me and Versal came and just like threw up this crappy wall around as fast as we could. But it doesn't work because it's crap. <laughs> it doesn't work at all. We still get raids in the middle of the village smashing on people's houses. It's crazy. Crazy time here in Valheim or Ravenheim. Oh, there's a Draugr. Oh, it's a one star. I oh, know. it's a crypt. Smitty is just spawning all these things as he runs ahead. Oh wait, ahead. someone's already done this one. He's a troublemaker. If you're wait, in what? that swamp where I am, I'm telling you, it's unlikely you're going to find one. We are. We're, we're in, in a, a different new one. Swamp by the oh, trader. Okay. Oh man. Let me see, where are you at on the map? Let me see if this is where I was with V. 
Oh yeah, this is this oh, already no, done. It's not. I have not been where you are, so I don't know who was there. B who? might have been it. Or it could have been Kaisen too. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Okay. The traitor? This one star is is bad news. I need yeah, help, be Mags. Oh, help no, me. I'm dealing with the one star of my own. What? Yeah. He's gonna kill me in two shots. Oh Just gosh! Stay away! Don't run! Don't run toward I'm, him! I'm running. He's an archer, though. Oh, that's not good. Let me eat a little bit. So I'm basically on you? standby in case. We need a rescue mission. <laughs> While I'm working on this. Where are you? Oh, is he, uh, around the crypt? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> no! <laughs> You're going circles around the crypt! <laughs> I am, because he's, he's sneaky. Oh. He's very accurate. <laughs> Alright, you just keep going. Ah! Oh, I just jumped over. <laughs> user where's oh. smitty smitty is running randomly through a swamp with magzag at the moment <laughs> yeah we're we're fine They're we're fine. just on top of a grip we're just the stuck one on top jogger. of one fine. yeah we're alive magzag never dies Shh, so don't say that that's terrible magzag, the deathless Who has zero de deaths in the game the only one I wish I could lie and say that I've died so many times. Also, now it's too I only have four deaths. What? Like, that's pretty good. It is. That is pretty good, Smitty. Well, yeah, we gotta go down there sometime. I think Rasa is the number one with like twenty-five deaths. Yeah, it's insane. <laughs> nice. He was like losing it the other day. He almost rage quit. <laughs> what do you do? What was going on? He like went up. He wanted to go in the mountains, so I had some frost potions, and so we went into the mountains. And um, got him. Sorry. And I had to go, yeah. and he went back because he wanted to train wolves. <laughs> and so oh. he trapped <laughs> wolves into a pit, got them trained. And then, what was it that came? Anybody in chat remember? Was it Drake's? I think it was, or did he get a raid from the swamp? I think he may have gotten a raid from the swamp. And they killed every single wolf. Oh, that's so disappointing. Yeah. Oh. He was it's not, not just first life. Wolves. Yeah, I think I saw a post about that actually. He was not happy. It would be hard to be happy if your wolves were killed by stupid drakes. Mm hmm So, yes, chat, I know this wall is still crap, but my goal today is to function first. <laughs> function first, and we'll pretty it up later, because I'm just tired of the crap. Getting in here. Maybe I'll have Smitty make it pretty. I can do a, a remodel later. Things. Yeah. Hmm. Wait, what are you up to, Meg? Where are you? Because I don't know what to do about this wandering. situation over there. Hmm. Wandering through the swamp here, mm. mindlessly, Sorry, aimlessly. That's not good. Okay, let me just take care of these, uh, growlers. <laughs> oh, that's a arrow. <laughs> hey, bowed drowger, go away. Got him. It's a wall, it's a wall, it's a big, janky wall. Yeah, it is. 
crappiest wall I've ever made in my life. <laughs> well, it does uh, uh, something. Yes, it does do something. Okay, Smitty, I'm going to have to log off. I think it's getting pretty late for me. Okay. All good. I can manage. In the swamp by yourself? You sure? I mean, we'll see. <laughs> you got this. <laughs> You're oh. hanging from the cliff cliff with one hand and you still survived. You yeah. totally... I can survive that. I can survive yeah. anything. It's mini survival. It's in your mm -hmm. name. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got to channel the inner survival. Mm -hmm. That proves it. You can survive. Okay, I'm running away from this off now. You got it. Goodbye. Although someone might have cleared out a lot of that swamp. If we found that crypt that was empty. Yeah. The sneaky feeling that might be the case. Hmm. Spawner is just. You better survive. Friendly. I'll be very disappointed if you die. I'll, I mean, I'll do my best. Mm. Oh, actually, you know what? Should I? No. Okay. If you All right, I'm cutting my loss. Help me with this. <laughs> I'll help you with the swamp yeah. afterward. That might be better. I mean, I'm not particularly interested in the swamp. I'm just interested in gold. So wherever that may be. Yeah, we can get gold in the black forest. It would be easier. We just want Much gold. Mm-hmm. Um, I gotta find my way back now. GK has a very good idea. I was gonna do, um, like sticks and stuff just for this temporary end of the enclosure, but TK made the suggestion to put boxes so Box that the mobs swim into them instead of swimming around, trying to swim around the fence. Oh. I don't think I've ever done it that way before, TK, but I'm going to give it a shot. That could be a thing. I'm going to do it from the other side. Gold, yes, for the trader. Yeah, oh. we get Smitty his. I've come across a troll. Um, mm. Gold opportunity. Yeah. Get, him. Like, get him. I can't, can't let it go by. No. Oh, he can't even see me. What an idiot easy. troll. So stupid. Maybe he's stuck. I don't know. Oh, no, he's after me now. Got this, Mini. Go get him. That's what we've trained you for. Alright, I'm gonna there head out. Go. It's fun playing with you guys. Alright, later. Thanks, bye. Bye, Magzag. Oh my gosh. What did you do? <laughs> <laughs> uh... Oh, that was tragic. You didn't die, right? Mmm. Uh. Maybe. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> uh, where are you at? Are you going to be able to get back to where you need to go? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's fine. Because it was just in the forest. Okay. <laughs> right as Megs gets off. <laughs> So you can say it's your fault. Mm. You abandoned me. Yep. Yep. <laughs> oh gosh.
What a fool. What a fool. Oh, we all have this. That's doing so well, too. I can't believe it. Well, we can't all be Magzag and never die. I know, I know. Just got a little too confident. I thought I could block. Like, he had a little, like, this, the little double fist uh, smash, and it went through my shield and killed me, oh, so. No. Alright, rescue mission. You can do it. Mm-hmm. Is this what you're talking about, Tiki? And then I turn it out. I don't know how far out I need to go to do it this way. I mean, sorry, not Tiki. TK. You can see why I would get those two confused. It's like Beevil Bum has me and KJ, and he's always like, Christy, KJ, KJ, Christy, Christy, KJ. <laughs> Who are you talking to? We can do this. Smitty left alone to die. <laughs> yeah. I was abandoned. This was not my fault. Fish trap? No, I'm not building a fish trap right now. I'm trying this idea of TK's where he said to make a U-shaped box on the end of the fence. So that the mobs will swim into there instead of swimming around the edge of the fence. So, we're gonna see how this works. I've never done it this way before. Hey MSG, welcome in. Good to see you, friend. TK says, might work. I would have done it on the other side of the fence and made the box smaller. On the other side of the fence. But then wouldn't they just try to swim around the end? I don't know. We'll see. This whole area right here is weird. We're definitely going to have to come up with a better situation for it. Because with all these little rocks and shallow parts, thing, things are going to be able to walk around and swim around. So we're definitely going to have to come up with a better solution. And it's right by Smitty and Unknown's house. And I'm sure they don't want this ugly looking thing sitting here. So <laughs> it'll have to be made prettier. Have a bit more finesse and design to it. But, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go around the edges. I have my wood pole out. I'm going to turn down my graphics too. To low vegetation. So I can see the ground clearly as I'm doing this. And then... Okay. Redemption. I have to take out this troll now. Do it. I go along the edge and I, if I find a part where I don't have a workbench, like right here, then I'm going to build a workbench. And that shows me the circle around me, the circumference of what it's going to cover. And no, no bomb will spawn within the circumference of a workbench or many other items. But I'm starting with workbenches just because it's easy to see and it's faster to measure. And then we can come back and make it pretty later and use different things however we want for spawn prevention. So I'm going to check back and make sure that crosses over so I don't have a hole, and it does. And then I'm going to keep going. And I'm going to do that in a grid over and over and over again for the entire inside of our village. It's a monotonous job sometimes, but oh my goodness, is it worth it when it's done? It's such a relief. Huh. Did you not deal with 
mob raids and spawns when you were building in creative at all or did you just kill everything whenever it got near your building? yeah so the thing is where i build on creative i have like zero progression on the actual game right so the only raid uh... i really get are the um the, the force is moving ones so like if that happens then yeah i can just kill like and i just dev command to kill them all really quick but I don't really struggle with with raids on on that on that world. Right. So you're not used to things coming in and knocking the crap out of your build. No, I'm not. And it freaked me out when it did happen. And I was so upset when that troll destroyed like that corner of the house. <laughs> it's just because people always comment on my videos. They're like, oh, like the ground is shaking. It's like, oh, ha ha. And then it actually happened, and I was like, oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, where'd this troll come from? What is going on? Alright, I guess I gotta take this guy down, too. Oh, he has a tree, though. Oh, boy. See the the fence is completely broken here. Useless, useless. Well, it hasn't been completely useless, but it hasn't been completely effective. It did save us some when Patrick the um Composer was here. So we got a little raid and we're shooting at arrows at things across the fence. I did not get that playing with a dev out this week. Because I had mm. to deal with other stuff, but that should be coming out on Monday. Hey Avanti, welcome in. Christy Eat. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, that old thing. See, that's where it's nice having a chat. I yeah. know, keeping tabs <laughs> on you. <laughs> Whoops. <clears throat> oh boy, this is Scott. So if I go if I go into the trader area, will enemies follow me? No, there's a magical bubble around the trader that you can kind of see when you get there, and they can't go inside that. So okay, if you just... go in there and you want me to sleep, I can. Yeah, that might be better because there are a lot. It's this forest is not too nice right now. I yeah, to... nighttime is the right time for creepers. Come and get you. Ugh. Ugh. Uh, stamina. Have you been back to your actual house lately? Me? Yeah. No, I haven't actually. Cause ever since I did the uh, hype house, mm -hmm. like my my bed's now in that house. So it's been a little bit. Should I be going back to my? Well, I mean, it could use a little bit of upkeep. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm sure. Um, I think some people had left you some presents too, maybe, but. Presents? Yeah. Like actual presents or? Yeah, like. Not so I nice put, presents. I put something in your bottom chest on the right of your fire. Oh, okay. I know that you actually saw that then. And there, I also put a present sitting in your house. Take a look. I mean, they're not like gift wrapped or anything like that. <laughs> it's 
It's all welcome. <laughs> Tiki says, first non-dev death stream ever. That's not true. Not <laughs> true. Troublemaker. See what you're doing. It's patently false. Had many times that I've played with the devs and they did not die. I have had many times when I died. <laughs> or they died or we both died. But you know, I was thinking about this uh, rumor that's going on about me killing devs. And you know why <laughs> it seems like I kill devs? It's because devs are playing the game with me. Hmm? Hmm? They wouldn't be dying if they weren't playing the game. Mm. Right? So it's not the same as if they just like go talk on a phone obviously they're not gonna die when they're just doing an interview <sighs> so i combat this whole notion <laughs> and i tell any of them when they come in the number one rule is you're not allowed to die <laughs> <laughs> cannot die See, this is the problem with these wood walls, too. Moms love to attack them. Oh. Alright, I am back. You can see me through the gap. I need to see what exactly you're up to over here. Okay. It's horrible. <laughs> but. It'll work. That's all I care about right now. Hello. Oh. Hello. So what exactly are you doing? Okay. So, like, there's a workbench here, right? Yeah. And so, if I pull out, like, a wood pole, I see that I can build here. I'm within the circumference of the workbench, right? Mm-hmm. So, if I go this way along the fence... I'll get to the point where I pass that circumference and then I see, okay, have I now entered the circumference of another one? Can I still build? Yes, I can. Okay, I can keep going. Because that thing is going to spawn within the circumference of a workbench. Oh, okay. Uh, then, is this trolls that did this with all these trees? This is craziness. Um, there have there been quite a, a few troll, troll raids in here. And so then I keep going and I look for holes. And I'm making a grid. First I'm going around the whole exterior of the fence. Oh. And then I'll start making a grid going inwards. To make sure, because there, if there is a single hole in the coverage, when a raid happens. We'll go right there. It'll go right there, and it'll spawn inside, and it'll be like, well, that didn't matter at all. Oh, oh. I found the hole. Such a big space to... Yeah. ...cover on this. Yep. We wanted a large village, so... Yeah. Too large coverage. <laughs> oh, no, that was the, the best decision here. <laughs> I mean, I've covered large spaces before. This may oh, be yeah. the biggest one, though. I think there's a good chance that it is. Where is the workbench that's covering this one? Right here. It needs to go back. And a lot of times, too, I've done, like, I mean, I would upgrade this to a stone wall. Mm-hmm. And you could do a, um, what you doodle, a moat outside the whole thing. Oh. Dig a trench mm. around the whole entire outside. 
is a possibility. And I placed down campfires as I was running around frantically. Um, somebody said the other day they didn't think the campfires were working. Like anti spawn. Prevention anymore. Yeah. So I haven't gone and tested that yet. I need to do that. But I know 100% that workbenches always work, so it's just where I'm starting. Okay. So. Do you want to, like, start from the other end, or what do you think? Yeah, I was running down this, uh, this side of it. Wait, where did, where did you start? I started over by your house at the very end and started coming up. Oh. So then I... Should I just start with like a layer inside then? Um, you could. If you start over at the same side at your end, yeah. where your original house okay. is. And yeah, I'll start one layer in. Gotta stock up on some materials then. Yeah. Don't forget to. Also check the coverage in the middle of the town. Yeah, we're starting at the fence, doing that whole line around, and then we're going to work our way in like a grid, one ring at a time. It's kind of like the FBI when they're combing a field for dead bodies. You know, <laughs> you work in a grid pattern. <laughs> How dare you back here. Thank you. Bacon. <laughs> hey, Ken. Welcome to the stream. I just stick to workbenches and wards as they both prevent spawns. That's true. Both of those will. Workbenches are cheaper to build. Wards are prettier, but right now we're being functional. We'll make it pretty. Yeah. Better. Yeah. There's quite a few things that prevent it. There's like torches can prevent it. There's a lot of ways to do it, but. Get the manual labor out of the way first. Hi, KJ. All right. Welcome in, friend. How are you? Fires don't fear brutes and shamans. That's true. Jonathan was at my treehouse build one time and um, I don't know we came in from doing something and mm. kind of went over the moat and past the wall and he said he made a comment about people have gotten so good at spawn prevention raid prevention sometimes I think that we need to make the raids harder like coming oh, from yeah. the air where you can't stop them mm -hmm. and I was like really? <laughs> it's like that sounds like a hassle <laughs> we kind of did right with the isn't the bat raid kind of that? yeah we are going to have the bat raids now with the um caves update but mm -hmm. bats don't do a huge amount of damage okay but they will get in your house they'll get inside your house oh that's annoying <laughs> yeah and they can get in a small space 
Like, they're about the same size as a Duskito. But Duskitos don't really fly as erratically. Okay. Um, and try to come at you in your house where bats will. So that's going to be a whole other thing. How do you protect your stuff from a swarm of bats? Yeah. I mean, you can have windows and shutters and that kind of thing, but I'm thinking drawing them away from your build. And especially drawing them away from your livestock. Because if you have <laughs> right. a boar farm, That's... or a mm. lox farm, or tamed wolves, they'll take them out. Yeah, that's... Don't want our pets going down. No, don't take out very vicious! Don't take out very vicious! Stop! Whew! I think I got one. Okay. Oh, that one's not a very fish. Phew! I don't want to take out bushes. Hmm. Uh oh, out of wood. Yeah, that's why I'm back over here chopping all these that I guess got either knocked down by trees or V might have planted these as a tree farm back here yeah. in this corner. It's possible. Your livestock are locks, nothing much takes them out. Mm. The mosquitoes will. Wolves would. Shh. Eat, Christy. Uh, I got a little bit. I got a little bit left. I mean, if we got a raid or something, I would. Be real this will last. For a and then, but I was telling him too. You know, we do get the Drake raids. You can't protect from them. Um, but fortunately, they don't usually do a huge amount of damage to builds. I don't know. Maybe it's because I pull them away. Because they terrify me. <laughs> yeah. The, the swamp raid seems kind of dicey. Yeah. They love beating on houses. Uh-huh. I should have gone and gotten the elder. Which? Uh oh, I'm gonna get some rain. On a user needs to be near three base items for raids to occur. Yeah, it doesn't take very many. Things. Except for the wolf raids. You don't have to be at a base. Make a cart, Christy? That would make entirely too much sense. <laughs> <laughs> And we have 
little bit brown. Mom, they can just walk right in. Nice welcoming uh. week for them. Welcome to our village. Please, come to serve me. I told him when he was building this, I was like, how are you going to defend that? He's like, I have a plan. <laughs> but the plan requires him to be here. Yeah. Yeah, see, right here, even before his fence is ended, mobs can spawn, literally, within the space of his fence. I mean, I don't want to like do stuff to mess up the build, obviously, but something's going to be a I'll put things in like obvious places. Hey, Bobby McGee. The storm is louder than my voice. Okay, let me turn the storm down. Thank you for letting me know. Let me know if that's better or if it's still too loud. Thank you, Vincent, for letting me know that. And Rick. Oh yeah, but Smitty, then Jonathan, I, cause, but then Jonathan ended up making the statement that, like he didn't really think that they would do anything that would destroy everybody's builds. Cause I was like, well, at least the drip yeah. raids are early on, you know? Right, right. It's like there's just like a balance in the game where like yes it's grindy but you don't want to create a loop where stuff is just constantly getting destroyed and you're constantly having to grind and like repair stuff and we do the same thing yeah you know i don't think that's a loop that's like super enjoyable or anything yeah yeah, when he said, I don't think we have to worry about anything, I was like, and all the builders yell, yay, because... <laughs> I mean, yeah, you can get really good at spawn prevention, but... There's a reason for that, because once you get to a point in game... You know, you've spent enough time and effort, you don't... You don't want things destroying your stuff. Yeah. Much better? Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Perfect. Yeah, see, and he, like, has this whole smelting area and gardens coming outside of the wall of the village. I don't... I don't know how he's going to protect all this. In the meantime, I'm going to make an ugly thing right here. Huh. That's just going to keep the mobs from walking through. So on my community server, we try not to dig moats around builds because they're really ugly. And yeah. Don't look the best for sure. Yeah, I mean, it can be done well, you know, but... A tasteful moat? Yeah. But anyway, I did a 
stream with Dipstick. You're familiar with Dipstick, right? Mm-hmm. He's a really good builder, and he kind of did a thing with us on how to prevent mobs from getting in your base without digging trenches. Oh, nice. And one of his uh, big recommendations was to use stairs and ladders facing outward. So, like, mobs can walk up stairs, but they can't walk up them if they're backwards. And they can't oh. walk up ladders at all, but they certainly can't get past them if they're backwards. And the thing is that mobs do not attack ladders. Oh, interesting. So, like, all the stick walls that we built all the way around, it was quick to throw around the village, but mobs will try their best to knock them down and succeed. But if they come to a series of ladders in a row, they'll just stand there. And they might attack, if they see you on the other side of it, they'll try to attack you and might incidentally hit the ladders, but they uh -huh. don't attack ladders or stairs. Even if it's a troll, even if it's uh -huh. goblins, everything. I think it's night. Should we sleep and try to get some sleep? Yeah, I night? can. I can sleep. Well, I can get into my house. Jeez. <laughs> oh. Alright, well, you know what? I can't sleep because I have been trapped. No, you can get in there. Ah, uh, yeah. Why can't I. All right, come on now. There we go. All right. Maybe V's plan is a wolf army. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Level the ground, then place the workbench. Yeah, I could. That's true. Oh, there's Did a stone cutter in here too. Yes. Oh my gosh. That was I just one got of a your gifts. Ton of new pieces. What? And you have you have another gift too. Another gift? Mm-hmm. Oh. Is this the iron? Yep. Oh, I was wondering where all that went. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yeah. the spoils from our previous adventures. Oh, I'll have to I'll have to put that to use. For sure. Here, Looks I'll give heavy. you some more presents. Here you go. You can have a rock and some deer meat and a deer skin well, and some tails all... and four strikes. Alright. I will go get them. Oh no! They went through the ground. <gasps> yeah. Is there a trap here? A trap. That's what you were talking That's about. That's what I was talking about. I didn't even know this was here. Oh. <laughs> or maybe I did at one point and I forgot or something. I don't know. That's funny. So it wasn't you? <laughs> it was not me, no. I, oh, have not, okay. I have not dug a pit in anyone's house. Have I? Have I chat? I don't think so. Level the ground and then place the workbench. Yeah, I could. I'm just trying to keep it natural if I can. I I did put some doors on your house. <laughs> yes, yes, I did. I did see. <laughs> Online user says, I did a moat, but started with the hill village, so it looks kind of natural. That's a cool idea. Raising the ground also works. Yeah, ground walls are impervious to every mob. We've been trying not to do that at the village. We've been trying to do things that look more, I guess, realistic, kind of. Mm-hmm. But. Oh, this so this is, is the... Is the cafe. This is the can 
I'm cafe, sure. yeah. Oh, you're going for the log floor. Yeah. Gonna need a lot of wood. Very, very nice. Thank you. So this is gonna be like the little viewing of the pond area. And then I like it. You go up here and it's gonna be like outside dining area. And then the next level up here is going to be like the inside dining area. Have some little views. Yeah, I'm glad we we're making use of that pond because I always yeah. thought it looked kind of nice. And you can find a way to make that I cool, right? Think this is the perfect way to display it. I'm debating if um, I should leave it natural looking like this or if I should do more to make it look. Manicured, what do you think? Mm-hmm. What would you like do for it? Like line it with some stone and stuff and something like that, yeah. Like a boardwalk around it? Maybe. I would probably ask Smitty. What do you think you would do with this spot? Mm. <laughs> Get ideas. I mean it kinda looks neat just being natural like a natural kind of area yeah you could do some sort of like curving like mm -hmm. boardwalk in some areas that where you could maybe like sit up closer to it it's kind of hard to tell until um you see like the full structure behind mm -hmm. it right like yeah how that all works together yeah because i i have an idea in my mind for this but i don't have like a you know, like, drawn-out master plan for everything. Yeah, yeah. It's just kind of coming together. Yeah. And then this is going to be, like, a see-through. The hearth here is going to, the sun's going to be going high. And then on the other side back here in the hearth, this is going to be the actual kitchen cooking area. All back here and storage for all the cooking stuff and the advanced cooking stations and then I'll have either like a back door although I was kind of thinking the back of it kind of does face the village so I might make it look kind of pretty and do like another little outside seating area in the back patio almost mm. like there's you know a back patio dining and a front entrance and I want to have easy access to the kitchen from both sides you know so wherever people are running from to cook they'll be able to get into the kitchen and the kitchen storage quickly and then my hey, living quarters yeah. are going to be above the kitchen like I live there in my restaurant oh look there's the iron from my stone cutter <laughs> In a box because they destroyed it. <clears throat> um, banana. Hey, Steph Dev, how are you? I place sharp stakes at the base of the ladders. Yep. That's a good idea, too. They line up well. Cyborg. Hey there. Yes, village is looking good. Thank you. It's coming together. Some pieces look more together than others. <laughs> yeah. But we're getting there. Definitely. <laughs> <clears throat> Um, but you can sculpt the raised ground to look natural and fit in with the areas. That's true. I could. Even if I make it more natural looking, I can still sculpt it to be more the shape that I want it to be. It's a possibility. Iron Age mounds and forts raise the ground for borders. Do you mean like in real life? 
that's what they did? That would make sense. Yumagami says, add a tree and leave it natural. That's a possibility. Put like a tree down in the middle of it, you think? Or you could just outline it here and there with some landscaping. Grassing, yeah. I did regrassing it already, so that's kind of what it looks like. All natural. At the edge, yeah. Um, so, where are you at, Smitty? Are you going across the front um, now? I'm over oh, on no, this side. Yeah, I'm just kind of layering in the workbenches. Okay. I'm going to go across the front edge, since I just did the back edge. This little bay between your and unknown's house is going to be tricky. Yeah, we got some necks that just kind of come out of nowhere. Oh my gosh, I always forget about this stupid hole. <laughs> <laughs> should fill it back up. Or put the floor back. I should. One of my uh, pranks that I did this week for V is that I went and undid one of his pranks and didn't tell him. Oh, no. <laughs> hmm. So he did a prank on Kaisen where he put a... Um, he put a hole inside his door, covered it with... Um, rugs, of course. And then, in the hole, he planted a 45-degree roof that when he walked into the hole from either side in the house or outside the house, he would slide down the roof into a <laughs> portal that would take him <clears throat> into the middle of nowhere on a tree branch that when he came out of it would make him fall off the tree branch and onto the ground so he can get back to the port. That is brilliant. <laughs> it kind of is. <clears throat> I was thinking we could uh, implement something similar. It's going to be like a punishment uh -huh. model awesome. where it's like you have, you have like a bunch of portals. You see you have like two or three portals and we mix up where each portal goes each time and it's kind of like a russian roulette and one of them might lead to death or one might lead to like a like pit of trolls or something like that <laughs> but it's like if you're like found guilty of something you gotta do like the portal roulette the portal see roulette. what happens that yeah would be fun. that'd be funny yeah People have been quite responsive to come up with ideas to get him back. <laughs> <laughs> well, he, he was behaving so well for a while. I know. And then, and then his, his more devious ways came out again. Came flying back in a rush. <laughs> hey, Beeble Bomb, how are you? Welcome in, friend. Good to see you. Don't look at this horrible job that I'm doing, Beeble. Beeble is a <laughs> fabulous builder mm -hmm. in Valheim and No Man's Sky. In case y'all don't know, you should check him out. He just put a video out of um, one of his builds on our last server, Bela's Rest. 
which was really pretty. It was a, um, like a bridge gate build that you could sail under. It was really pretty. I am an okay builder. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> This is quite the project here. Yeah, it is. And honestly, this is something that probably I would more often than not do off stream. Just because it's just a lot of boring work. <laughs> but it needs to get done and I've had limited time off stream to play so I'm like mm -hmm. I'm doing it and then I thought too there are probably some people that literally don't know how to do this you know they've never I done don't, it before I, I've never even thought of this yeah so I thought it might be useful to some people that have never thought about it or had to do it before or anything so hopefully some people are getting some helpful info from it too. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm out of wood. There needs to be one right here. Kind of in this area. Okay. I think, uh... I mean, and it kind of shows the amount of detail that needs to go into it if you're, like, going to have a big build and not have it destroyed by mobs, like... Yeah. It takes commitment <laughs> to keep them out. Seriously. All right, Christy, I actually have to head out, but uh, good luck with the rest of this project. Oh my gosh, this so many doors. Gosh. <laughs> That's what right, happens yeah. when you don't go home for so long. I the know. It's, <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was kind of asking for it on that one, but yeah, well, good luck with the rest of that uh, gridding project. Thanks. Really appreciate the... The work on that. Yeah, yeah. For sure. I'll All see right. you soon. I'll catch you later. Bye. Um, let's see. Will you be doing all the builds? Um, I am gonna do everything inside the village walls. Not today on stream. I'm not gonna <laughs> finish it all. Because it's gonna take a while. But yeah, it's my goal to have the whole... The whole thing... Spawn-proofed. So that nothing can spawn inside the village. At all. That's the goal. Um, Greg says, find a circular stone tower in the mountains, pickaxe the central floor pillar, and put the portal in the sub-basement. <laughs> yeah, the, the idea that he did where he put the slide into a portal and put the portal in the middle of nowhere thing to Kaisen... Um, was actually something that was mentioned in my Discord. 
and then some prank ideas that somebody had and so it was like I don't know if this is where you got this idea but I'm gonna ban you from seeing this room <laughs> cause then he would just like come in there and post eyeballs like he's sticking around I'm like nope get out get out you're banned <laughs> And then I kind of felt bad for Kyson because, you know, kyson has been kind of gone for a little while. Not able to do a lot because he just does a lot going on. And I was like, you know, I don't want him to come back and say, oh, yeah, I finally got back in. And then he gets transported to falling off a tree in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> I was like, no. Not going to do it. So I foiled his, I foiled the prankster's plan and I broke the portal. So <laughs> when Kaisen falls in the hole, instead of getting sent through a portal, he'll just get the mats for a portal put in his inventory. <laughs> Weevil says, you know what my plan is with protecting against mob spawn from now on? Portal inside a rock and place the workbench inside them. Yeah. There are probably some rocks around here that might be big enough to do that. I don't know. There's not as many big rocks in the meadows, obviously. But that's definitely a safe way to do it. Especially like in the plains. Boo, Christy, Kyson wanted pranks. He got pranks. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, there's going to be plenty of pranks. He's still getting pranked. Don't worry. <laughs> kind of pranking B, too. Messing up his prank. We all got to gang up on Versa. Because he went back to his dark ways. He was being so nice. Place wards under the ground. You talking about for spawn prevention or are you talking about for a prank? Because that could be done for either one. <laughs> but we are trying to not do anything that will like mess up somebody's build. Or keep them from being able to play because we accidentally had a situation. Remember Beeble Bum on our first server? Where somebody put a ward in their build. And um, it was too close to somebody else's house. And then the neighbor came in and they couldn't get in their house or open the doors or anything. So they're like, well, I guess I'll leave because they couldn't play. <laughs> Beeble says, I have a feeling I would get along with V very well. Yeah, I have a feeling that you would. Maybe I should keep you two separated. <laughs> this could be a dangerous combination. <laughs> ah, kidding. For spawn, you don't need to activate it. That is true. But wards are more expensive to build than workbenches. So right now I'm just going for quick and dirty. Just to get her done. And then we'll go back and make things pretty. And I'm out of wood. But where am I at? Right here by my house. Let me get some daylight. Oh. But I can't light my fire. I'm out of wood. I know, I'm not totally out of wood. There. Watch, as soon as Smitty leaves, I'm going to end up getting a raid. <laughs> um. 
A non-user drop V's pit with pants all over the floor. He has to pick up to get out. <laughs> Anon, did you see when I filled up all of his chests with pants? Those are no pants, gang. <laughs> he deserved it. <laughs> oh, thank you, TK. And thank you for the 29 likes, guys. I appreciate it. Anyway, Christy, you're going to have to go. Thanks for stopping by to say hello, people. We shall see you later. I did not see that perfect, though. Yeah. I took all of the food. Like, he built his new house. Which, by the way, was really dumb timing. I gotta say. He built that beautiful house over on the end over there and then immediately proceeded to prank like four different people on the same day. Like, that's just asking for trouble. <laughs> you did not plan this out well. And the ideas I had suggested to me were much worse than what I ended up doing, partly because I ran out of time. <laughs> I went good. All of the food out of his, um, oh, I never got, went and got wood. Out of his chest by his cooking station. And I hid them in another part of I, his space. Like, oh, I think here. somebody forgot to hang up their mic. Like Let me go them. take care of that real quick. Yeah, and we're gonna... Mute. I don't even know. I'm gonna hang up from there because what just happened? Hang up. Okay. I'll have to DM him and let him know he left his mic running. Give me just a second to do that. Look at the pretty water. <laughs> Over here. Hello. You left your mic on. Okay. Cool. That'll fix it. <clears throat> yeah, so I hid all of his food. And I replaced every single spot in all of his food chests with pants. And then he hadn't noticed it because we were like doing other stuff. And so then we were getting ready to go out and I'm like, no, come here, come here. Oh, that's not what I meant to get. He wanted food. He's like, do you have any food? I'm like, no, you can't have my food. Come here. I'll show you how to make something. And I took him. <laughs> so like in there, he's like, what? <laughs> Pants. So now I can't say that he doesn't have pants anymore. Okay, where was I at when I left off? I was over here, right? Right near the front of my house. Pretty sure, pretty sure. Yup. I'm gonna have to go out and get those little islands too. So let me turn my graphics back down so it's easier to see what I'm doing. That makes it easier. Oops, get out of there. Okay. So I need one here. I'm gonna need one here. Might be 
able to start a raid from over here. So get some on this island too. Run, run! Why are you knocking me into the water? It's not very bright, is it? Die. 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 More reason to punch Graylings now. Get the fist skill up. Since we have a fist skill now, instead of unarmed. Hmm. Didn't really check on my stamina before the swim. There, I can stand here a little bit. It'll be fine. <laughs> Turn neck into minced meat. That's true. They're good building food. Oh! I want to grab a fish out of water so bad. Never been able to do it. Okay. Almost all the way around. This should be covered by mine. And this should be covered by Jirox. Oh no, there's a hole between me and Jirox. Where is it at? Just right here. Okay. I'm going to put it behind this tree then. Hmm. That's why I had that there. Okay, that covers the hole. Now we're getting close to V. He's got coverage for the most part, but we got a hole right here in the middle. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to send him a message on Discord because he's gonna come back and be like, why did somebody set all this crap around my base? <laughs> There was a reason. But I did, um, I did say I was going to be working on spawn prevention, so he could probably guess. That island might be a good spot for a lighthouse. Ooh. And hi, Mars Wraith. Welcome to the stream. That's true. It is kind of out there in front a bit. Hmm. Like with a big bonfire in the top. That could be cool. I want to be able to work on finishing up my cafe. I don't think if there was a lighthouse there, it wouldn't block the view from the cafe, though, because that's farther down. Yeah. I mean, we have done a good job of keeping things spread out. But yeah, that would be kind of pretty if there was a lighthouse over there with a big fire on the top of it. Even in the mist when it comes in like this, that would be cool. Well guys, I think I am coming to the end of my stream time for today, but let's check and see if there's anybody else that's streaming Valheim right now that we could go and raid. Let's see if I can search for Valheim Live. Um, 
A lot of times I've been forgetting to do this at the end of streams because, you know, I haven't been streaming that long. And so sometimes I forget stuff. <laughs> but let's see, is anyone live right now? Hmm. I don't see anyone live right this second. Beeb's just started? Oh, okay. Well, he's probably in No Man's Sky. Is he in Valheim? Why isn't he showing up in my list then? He should automatically show up in my list. Let me reload it. He is not showing up in my list. Um, KJ or TK, do y'all have? Okay, there it is. Okay, so everybody, thanks for joining me in the stream today very much. And hopefully some of you guys got some tips or ideas from this. And I appreciate your company and watching our shenanigans and everything. And I did not unsubscribe from MKJ. <laughs> oh my gosh. Beeble Bum is a fabulous builder in No Man's Sky and in Valheim, and he's picking up Valheim again, and so I'm excited. I'm going to go hang out with him. Click on the link. Go tell him hi. Give him a thumbs up. Put a hashtag Christy Raid in the chat so he knows where we're coming from, and I will see all of you beautiful people very soon. Until next time, happy gaming!